Hello everyone. Today we are discussing about types of soil from the chapter Resources and Development, Class 10 Geography. The first soil type is alluvial soil. This alluvial soil is found in northern India along the river valleys of Ganga and Indus and Brahmaputra in the east. Towards the south, it is found along the river valleys of Kaveri, Mahanadi, Krishna and Godavari rivers. In terms of composition, it contains sand, silt and clay and it also has potash, phosphoric acid and lime which supports the cultivation of crops like paddy, wheat, sugarcane, cereals and pulses. Some special features, this soil can be classified on the basis of age, khadar and bangar. Khadar is new soil, bangar is old. Bangar contains kankar like particles whereas khadar contains fine particles. Khadar is more fertile, bangar is less fertile. The next soil type is black soil which is also called the regar soil. This is found along the Deccan Trap region of Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh. It is composed of fine clay material which contains calcium carbonate, magnesium, potash and lime. This black soil is also known as black cotton soil because it supports cotton cultivation. A special feature is that the soil is self-aerated. It develops cracks during the dry season and turns sticky during the rainy season. The next type of soil is the red and yellow soil, found along Odisha, Chhattisgarh and the Piedmont region of Western Ghats. This soil develops on crystalline metamorphic rocks. It has the presence of iron particles. And this soil supports cultivation of plantation crops like coffee. The soil is red in color due to diffusion of iron particles. However, when the soil gets hydrated, it turns yellow and so the name red and yellow soil. The next soil type is laterite soil which comes from the word later meaning brick. This soil is found along Maharashtra, northeast regions of India and also in certain southern states like the Karnataka, Kerala and Tamil Nadu. Found in the tropical and subtropical regions with alternate wet and dry seasons, the soil is deficient in plant nutrients. However, this soil supports cultivation of plants like cashew nut and also plantation crops like tea and coffee. A special feature of this soil, this soil is actually a result of leaching due to heavy rainfall and it is also prone to erosion and degradation because of its location. Arid soil as the name suggests, this is a dry kind of soil found along the deserts of western Rajasthan. In terms of composition, it is extremely high in salt content and lacks humus and moisture. It is sandy in texture, saline in nature. In terms of crops, the soil is cultivable with proper irrigation, so Jawar Bajra can be cultivated in arid soil. The kankar layer present in this soil restricts infiltration of water. Forest soil is the last kind of soil. As the name suggests, it is found in the hilly and mountainous regions in India. In terms of composition, it is loamy and silty in the valleys, whereas it is coarse in the upper slopes. Crops, mountain vegetation and forests are found along here. The soil found in the lower part of the valleys are extremely fertile. However, this kind of soil experiences denudation and they are acidic in nature. Learn something new? Stay tuned for more useful videos.